Okay, so let me just run you through really quickly um, where you go in to find this new detailed targeting in Facebook advertising. So I'll just access my ads account through my own personal profile. And I'm doing this rather than through the business account because there's quite a lot going on in there at the moment. Uh, so what we do is we just uh, go up to the top right here and click on create ad. To get into this, we need to get into the ad set component, which is where the audience is set, which you can see in this section here. Now, you can't get through to that section until you've actually selected a campaign objective. So for this one, we'll just do promote your page, which is uh, just to get page likes on a page. And I'll just choose our main page, which is nudge marketing. And now I want to set our audience and budget. So I click through to the next step. And as you can see, it is now hopped down into the ad set for audience. Now, I've currently got this set up um, for Australia, as I'm based in Australia. I've got uh, 18 to 65, which I'm not going to change, and it's for all people. Now, this is where things now get exciting, which is this detailed targeting section. Um, let me just get rid of what I've got here at the moment. Okay, so in the detailed targeting section here, you want to include people who match at least one of the following. So let's just start with an example of marketing. We'll choose that from the drop down menu. And you'll see this has actually got a potential reach at the moment of 3 million people. Since I've typed marketing in here, this new selection of narrow audience is selected. So if I click on narrow audience, what that's going to do is bring up a second box which says and must also match at least one of the following. So this is the and that I was talking about earlier in the blog. So if we type in small business as an example, you will notice that the potential reach here is now dropped to 1.1 million, which is actually getting really close to a great size for a new audience, for a cold audience to actually target for a like campaign. Now, you could actually go even further with something like this if you wanted to and include even more ands, and you could also exclude people. So, um, for example, you might want people that are in marketing that have small business, but you don't want people that work from home. So if you type in uh, work from home, let's see if that's done anything. Okay, that hasn't actually, that hasn't changed at all. This audience was actually quite small. As you can see, there's only 230,000 people in it. But it's really a case of playing and just, um, really honing in on on exactly what it is that you are wanting or the people that you're wanting to target. So you start with your main objective up here, so that the big umbrella term that you're actually wanting to target, and then you just start adding different keywords and different audience uh, words that you would like to target. And then if there's anything specific that you want to exclude, that's where you can do this as well. Um, once you get this right, you will find that your Facebook advertising will really start to take off. So it is worth spending some time and really getting to know the platform. So I hope that's uh, been interesting. And if you do have any questions, please don't hesitate to um, send me a question in the comments below. I'll catch you again soon. Bye for now.